Hello and welcome to lecture number four. In this lecture, I'm going to show you how you can configure the firewall on your MicroTik router so you can block Facebook and YouTube on your wireless network. By end of this lecture, we'll be able to work on the MicroTik firewall, define a layer seven protocols using the regular expression, and then we have to apply the layer seven protocol inside the filter in the firewall to block the Facebook and YouTube traffic, okay? So the, the first thing you need to do is you have to reset your configurations. So the configuration that you had on the previous lab, you have uh, really to uh, remove it. And then you have to uh, make your router a wireless access point. And then you have to follow again lab number two. Uh, if you can do it uh, still yourself, you can just scroll to lab number two and then you make your MicroTik router a wireless access point again. So uh, for me, I will not do the steps because those were already uh, done previously. But I, I just want to show you again, if you want to reset your router, you can just go to system and then here you have reset configuration and just click on no default configuration. So you have a zero configuration on your router and then you will reset it, it will be rebooted and then afterward, uh, you follow the uh, lab number two to make it uh, a MicroTik access point router. Okay, for me, I have already done these steps, so I will uh, not go through that. So as you can see, at this moment, I'm connected to lab two test and uh, I have internet connectivity. So the step number one and two are already done. Now we have to go directly and check how we can do the firewall in a way to uh, this allow people to connect to Facebook. At this moment, if I go to my internet without any firewall, if I say facebook.com, um, you can see I can, can log into Facebook. I can put my, my email, my password, and then I'm inside my, fa my Facebook. So I, what I want to do now is to just make what is needed so I can't have access to the Facebook because me, I'm now a user on, on this wireless, right? So my IP here is 10.0.0.254 and this is the IP of the uh, WLAN1 here of the router. So I'm connected wirelessly now to the internet uh, or to the router. Okay, so to do that, let me first go here to MicroTik router and from here you have to go to IP and then to firewall. Okay. And uh, from the firewall here, you have something called layer seven protocols. Okay. What is layer seven protocols? It is a, a you point on an application, which is on layer seven. So uh, the firewall will be looking on the layer seven of the Aussie model. Okay. And then we need to use what we call the regular expression. Let me show you. I will create a new one here and I'll say here, I will put in any name, say block traffic. Okay. And here is the regular expression. I have already made the regular expression here because they asked us to, to block Facebook. So this is really what we need to copy and paste here. This is the regular expression. I say apply and I say, okay. Till now, my Facebook is still working. And here is, I can show you here, that even though that we have put the regular expression, I still have access to my Facebook. But now, what we can do is we can use this regular expression or the layer seven protocol, and we have to go to the filter over here, and then we say plus. I have to choose in the chain is input, output, or forward. The difference between the three are Forward are the traffic which are passing through the router to outside, means like the internet. I am get connected to the router, but I don't want to connect the router directly. I want to connect to the internet or the Facebook server, which is outside the router. And there I have to choose the forward. Input is any connection to the router directly. It's like Winbox connection is coming to the router, Telnet, SSH, those are really to the router. And output is from the router to the outside. Okay. So in my case, I want to block Facebook for people who are in the, in the wireless network. That means they are passing through the router to go to Facebook. So I'll say chain is forward. Source address is the whole subnet. Okay. That I have 10.0.0.0 slash 24. So I don't want anyone 
who is connected to the wireless you, uh, to be uh, able to go to the internet. You can also here, if you want, put uh, specific IPs like uh, my IP and the IP of, or let's say a couple of IPs, but not my IP. You can also do that, okay? So I have to go to then to the advanced and then from here you can see layer seven protocols. You just click on it and then you have directly blocked traffic. Okay, so what I'm saying here, for any traffic going through the router to the internet, coming from this subnet 10.0.0.0 slash 24, and is trying to go to Facebook. So here is I'm pointing to Facebook, then the action is to drop them. And here we go. Apply. Okay. All right. So now if I try again to open Facebook, let's see. Facebook.com. You can see it's not working. But if I try to open now, say YouTube.com. Yeah, it is working. Facebook not. YouTube, yes. Okay. Facebook.com and not working. But if you want, I can disable now the filter that I have just created now, and you will see that Facebook will be working right away. So just let me close this, and then I will say, well, I want to disable, disable it. And now I try to make Facebook.com. You can see I can log inside Facebook. It's a really, really effective way to uh, to use the firewall inside Microtech. Let me get connected again. IP firewall, I will enable it. All right, so where are we now? Create a layer seven uh, regular expression is fine. Apply the filter to block Facebook to all users. So all users connected. We have done it also for all users, that's fine. Now adjust the layer seven regular expression to add YouTube in the blocking list. Okay, so you have decided that also you would like to block YouTube. Uh, this configuration, what we have now, uh, if I close this and then I open again, I do now facebook.com. It's not opening, but I do YouTube. It's working, right? So you have decided that also you would like to block YouTube. All you need to do is you can just go to layer seven protocol again, double click inside the regular expression that you have created here. Okay. And then you make a pipe. A pipe is, is like, if normally on my uh, keyboard is the shift with the, with the, with the backslash. Okay. Then you have this uh, pipe. Okay. And then here you write uh, youtube.com. All right. And then I say, apply okay as we have already the filter applied here though we don't need to make any new uh, rule okay so let me now just try to close all again because sometimes the browser has a question is open then youtube will open but now once we just close it and then we try now facebook.com and uh, we try also youtube.com and we try linkedin.com okay so linkedin is working facebook is not youtube is not and any other traffic like hotmail.com yeah it's working so here we go facebook down youtube down linkedin working Let's see if we have still any other steps to do. So we have created the YouTube here and the list, and then we have checked that Facebook and YouTube are both blocked correctly, then that's fine. So that is what I wanted to show you in this lab. I hope you enjoyed it and I see you in the upcoming lecture.